speaking to The Morning Show, the royal biographer claimed Meghan Markle's baby shower in New York was very elaborate and very public Mr. Morton said the Duchess of Sussex celebration with her American notorious friends was not royal like as he revealed the Queen would have described it as over the top He said, baby showers are more of an American tradition than they are a British one And the very elaborate nature of it, the very public nature of it. It was far more Hollywood than it was Holyrood House It was really something that, if the Queen even knew about it, quite frankly, she would have just thought, probably that it was a little bit odd, over the top But that's part of the Meghan effect. The Duchess had her baby shower in New York last week Despite the Hollywood guest list, the lavish event, which took place at the Marks Penthouse suite in New York City, was an intimate gathering of her closest friends who have helped her through her first year of royal life It was all baby talk, and she was getting lots of advice from her friends during the event which took place on 20 February, according to Meghan's longtime friend and wedding makeup artist, Daniel Martin It was exactly what she needed, and was a reunion for us too, who hadn't seen each other since the wedding, Mr. Martin told People Snow was falling outside, and it was so cozy we all sat on couches or on the floor and told stories and caught up It was like a family reunion. The baby is going to be loved by us all, he added The star-studded lineup of guests, including Amal Clooney, Serena William and Meghan's former Suits co-star Abigail Spencer were even treated to a flower arranging class The flowers were then donated to Repeat Roses, a charity that gifts bouquets to hospitals and support centers Stylist Jessica Mulroney and Misha Nanu, who is thought to have introduced Meghan to Prince Harry, also attended the event <laughs>